hello guys in this tutorial i will tell you how to calculate oxidation number of an element in a compound before learning the process of calculating it we should know first that what is oxidation number oxidation number often called oxidation state so don't get confused when i say oxidation state instead of oxidation number because both have same meanings basically oxidation number is an indicator of the degree of oxidation loss of electrons or gain of electrons in a chemical compound now what does it mean here by gain of electron or loss of electron for example if we have a compound cobalt chloride here chloride has minus 3 oxidation state and cobalt has plus 3 oxidation state this plus 3 is showing that cobalt has lost 3 electrons and minus 3 is showing that chloride has gained 3 electrons so that's how oxidation number shows as gain or loss of electron now here are some rules for calculating oxidation number rule number one total sum of all elements oxidation numbers should be zero suppose if we have HCl here chloride is minus one oxidation state and hydrogen has plus one you can see that the sum of their oxidation numbers like plus 1 and minus 1 is equal to 0. So this is rule number 1. That the uh, every sum or you can say total sum of all elements oxidation numbers should be 0. If you see another example, cobalt chloride. Here chloride has minus 3 and cobalt has plus 3 oxidation numbers. And if you take their sum it would also be zero this is rule number one rule number two oxidation number of an element in its free state is zero in this like suppose if we have only aluminium and it is not combined with any other element so its oxidation number would be zero same as for iron if it is in solid and uncombined state its oxidation state will be zero etc rule number three oxidation number of an alkali metal is plus one and alkaline earth metal is plus two it's very simple alkali metals are group one in family like uh, sodium potassium etc so sodium and potassium all have um, plus one oxidation number and alkaline earth metals are calcium, magnesium. All elements belong to group 2A family in periodic table. They are alkaline earth metal and they always have plus 2 oxidation number. Rule number 4 is uh, oxidation number of oxygen is usually minus 2. But if oxygen is bonded with fluorine, so its oxidation number will be plus 1 and in peroxide case will be minus 1. If you see example, in O2F2 here oxygen is bonded with fluorine. So its oxidation number will be plus 1 here. But here two oxygens are presents, present. So 2 multiplied by plus 1 would be plus so here oxygen has plus 2 oxidation number and same as uh, fluorine is a halogen and uh, halogens have uh, usually halogens have minus 1 oxidation number and here 2 halogens are present so 2 multiplied by minus 1 would be minus 2 sorry minus 2 and uh, if you see there's some plus 2 minus 2 this would be 0 and in peroxide case in H2O2 here oxygen has minus 1 oxidation state and uh, here also two oxygens are present so 2 into minus 1 would be minus and hydrogen usually have plus 1 oxidation state and here 2 hydrogen are present so 2 into 
plus 1 would be plus 2 and here also you can see that plus 2 minus 2 the sum of their oxidation numbers is 0 rule number 5 oxidation number of hydrogen is plus 1 but if it is in hydride form its oxidation number will be minus 1 hydride form like for example NaH this is sodium hydride sodium is alkali metal so its oxidation instead would be plus 1 and hydrogen has minus 1 so plus 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 oxidation number of halogen is minus 1 like fluorine chlorine bromine all usually have minus 1 oxidation number now, rule number 7 is very important if any charge present on a compound the sum of all elements oxidation number should be equal to that charge suppose if we have NO3 and here minus 1 charge is present on it and you have to find oxidation number of nitrogen here so what would we do we do a uh, we know that oxygen usually have minus 2 oxidation number so here 3 oxygens are present so 3 into minus 2 would be minus 6 here oxygen has minus 6 we take nitrogen plus 5 here because plus 5 and minus 6 is equal to minus 1 we take that number which gives us minus 1 like plus 5 minus equals to minus 1 suppose if we have uh, NO2 and it has minus 2 charge present on it here two oxygens are present we know that oxygen usually have minus 2 oxidation numbers so here two oxygens are present so 2 into minus 2 would be minus 4 here oxygen has minus 4 oxidation number and we have to find nitrogen oxidation is said so uh, its oxidation is said would be plus 2 because plus 2 minus 4 is equal to minus 2 so that's how we calculate oxidation number of any compound in an element thank you for watching